Hello everybody, ADDF Toxic here, and I just want to do a little album overview for my album Dwayne Edward and Planes, and it's it's a very short album, um, although I guess I do have shorter, but this one is was made for a uh, a video. Um, a dad's cousin Dwayne lives in one of those middle of nowhere places, so there's a lot of a lot of area to uh, fly the RC planes there. Um, dad actually did bring an RC plane out as well, but didn't get to fly it. Um, well, not not during the day, at least. He had he did go out later, but uh, um, Dwayne's cousin Edward was also out there, and they flew a few planes around. Dad had me bring my camera, and I recorded uh, some of the stuff and edited it, it so that times when the plane is really far away is not included in the video because you can't really see the plane, so there's no point in uh, um, still having that part in the video, kind of thing. Um, and Dad wanted to share this video with with Dwayne and stuff, so, uh, um, the sounds of, of the flying is not all that exciting either, so I, I wanted background music in this video, and this was before I discovered Kevin McLeod, um, I did not know that you could just go to his website, download free music, and put it in, so I had to write my own music, but that's okay, because I enjoyed it, um, but before, before that, I had, uh, um, made a comment that I should put in some oldies music, um, uh, because Dwayne would enjoy that, but, uh, um, I, I can't just take April Wine and throw it in the video and, uh, expect the copyright people to, uh, be happy with me. So, when I started making music for this, the first track, which is, uh, Edward's First Flight, uh, was inspired by the April Wine song, Ooh, What It Meant. And that's why the it starts off with a uh, it's actually a triangle, but it was that was kind of inspired by uh, Ooh, when a night starts with like a train bell or something. Um, it's actually not a train bell, but it obviously sounded like a train bell to me. And uh, like at the, at, the, at the train crossing, I mean. And then I got I started started putting in guitar and uh, that's power chords, so it didn't sound as bad as as full open position chords like in. Uh, in a Pinku Defeat song, um, but uh, yeah, and I think I was starting to kind of understand some of the music music theory concepts, like I didn't fully understand keys, but I think I was kind of starting to understand that um, this music isn't quite as random as some of my older stuff, um, and also in this song I, I decided to put in a bass guitar because uh, I'd, I'd never really done much with a full uh, like, guitar and, and bass, both. I, again, I, was, I think I'm starting to have, understand music concept, music theory concepts at this time. Well, I guess it's not really music theory, but I was starting to understand those kind of concepts at the time. Um, and actually, that's kind of where I really became, started to uh, write cool bass lines. There was another song I wrote, I don't know what song it was, but... I uh, I really wanted to include a cool bass line, um, and even Train Ride to Gamestown, which is one of the favorite, my favorite songs that I've written lately, and that's a, um, I, I wanted to put a cool bass line in there as well, but it, it didn't quite happen that way. But anyways, I'm going off topic here. Um, so I, I basically wrote a song for every flight, there are three flights in the video. Um, Edward's second flight. Um, I wanted to do kind of a more classical orchestral um, piece for this. I don't know. Well, the reason I wanted that is because if you haven't seen the video, spoiler alert: Edward's engine shuts off while he's flying, and um, so I wanted this to be really dramatic. And the only way I could think to do this was was some sort of violin thing, except I really didn't know how to do that. So I didn't expect this song, this song to turn out great, and it didn't turn out all that great, but it turned out okay, I think. Um, and then, and then Dwayne's flight um, turned out better than I expected. Um, that song, and uh, that song is done purely with piano, so it's kind of going back to where where I started making music, um, and uh, the reason I use just piano there. Uh, Edward was using a gas-powered plane, really noisy, 
things. And then Dwayne was flying an electric plane, and uh, it's uh, not not quite as noisy and almost more peaceful. So I decided to go with more peaceful piano stuff, and uh, it's a little bit repetitive, yeah, but uh, I, I quite liked it. And there's also uh, one point in that song where the music kind of leaves leaves you hanging a little bit. Dad never really liked that part, but I always did, um, because the plane kind of it came up and then just kind of s almost seemed to slow down, and uh, so I made the music kind of slow down there too. And I don't know. I always like that part, but uh, maybe that's just me. Um, so that's going to be it for this album overview. Like I said, it's a short one, and uh, um, again, just some thoughts about the music. This music that I wrote a while ago that I wanted to uh, share. So um, that's that. Thank you for watching. And have a good life.